Over there, this is one of my pee stops. Wait, do you pee on the electric fence? <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Clubs, all that, ladies, women, yeah, the whole nine yards, yeah. Now yeah. that I'm in, I do gay forum, so. I am in Denton, Texas, right now rushing to catch the A train to go to Dallas. Hopefully, I yeah, guys looking at his watch. Hopefully, I can get in time. Okay, great. sit down over here and actually do the intro and explain what I'm doing. So I live in Poland. I used to live in Denton some years ago and I use public transportation all the time but in the US I've never actually used it. So I wanted to see what happens if I try to go all the way from Denton down to Dallas and just to see how long it's going to take if it's actually practical because one of the things I tell people in Europe living in the United States will you drive your car everywhere. So right now this looks pretty empty, which is kind of you know no surprise. And we don't we can't go directly down to Dallas. We have to go all the way down to Trinity Mills and then make a change. You know, in Europe, I don't have a car. Um, I just use public transportation. And it's already clear that just even to use this train, I already needed to use my car. So I left like, 20, 25 minutes before the thing left and there was a train blocking my way that delayed me a bit and I had to park my car before I actually got on the train to to move on. So I know that's, you know, even if you can get from say one city to the next, there can still be a problem with like, you know, the actual public transportation in the city, which is very different than what you see in a lot of European places. That was the first leg of the journey, and that was about 45 minutes, I think. So I started at 3.30, yes, uh, 4.14. Um, so we are at Trinity Mills, and now I've got to figure out how to actually get to Dallas. So I want to get on the orange line. So I see green line, you got to figure out how to buy a ticket. So I didn't mention pricing, so it was only $1.50 to get between uh, Denton and this station, and I can go back and forth as many times as I want until it stops operating. And I think the last one is at like 9 p.m. I do ride this train quite often. Yeah. Do you feel it's unsafe or not? Not at all. Yeah. So pretty safe. The A line runs a tight ship. Yeah. What about into Dallas? Mm, it's a different, different animal altogether. Okay. Yeah, it was pretty safe. I felt coming from Denton, but yeah. well. Um, once you get to Dallas, you'll see what I'm talking about. Oh yeah, I can, well, <laughs> I'm kind of curious. That's one of the reasons I'm doing this. So what, what happens? There's no bathrooms here. What happens? No bathrooms, and you can go for I can, I, I take, my commute usually takes an hour and a half. Okay. And um, it's a long I need to use the restroom. And if I, that means I've got to get off the train and wait 11 minutes for the next one to show up. Mm -hmm. I'll do it. Yeah, but there's no place. It's like it going oneself, so I have to walk over there to that tree line. And you see those, you see those electrical uh, buildings over there. I do walk over there. This is one of my pee stops. Wait, do you pee on the electric fence? <laughs> no, I, I'm not that way. Uh, these these machines. I can tell you that I've had many, many, many instances where the machine wouldn't take my money. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be working. Well, let's look here. Let me, let me try. Right, here you go. This will take us to Dallas. I am boarding this train without any ticket because we actually tried to get a ticket and it didn't work. But I do have video evidence of trying to buy it since I was recording here. The train is awful loud. There's a lot more people in here right now, I think. So Olin is going to... Show me something when we get off the train. So there's big eyeball in Dallas, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. At the station, and then they'll give you a shuttle bus from this station with your ticket. You know, I'll yeah. buy your ticket. I'll give you a shuttle bus over to the airport. All right, so this is Dallas Love Field Airport. This is the second biggest airport in Dallas. Usually a DFW is a really big one. I'm walking distance from a Green Line uh, stop, and I told my wife, I said, but if you need, we just like, you know, yeah. grab a small suitcase each and just got on the green line and the next thing, you know, we know we're in Belize or something. 
Oh wow, yeah. You know, yeah, it's something normal in without, Europe. Would without get getting in an automobile. Yeah. You know? Well, that's that's a European experience. In America, I've never done that. But. Yeah, well. Okay, so we got off on Packard, and that took me an hour and thirty-seven minutes from when I started in Denton. But from my hotel, that would have probably been actually about two hours. So I had to drive down, then there was a train getting in the way. So uh, kind of a long time. That's like going to a whole different city even. Oh yeah, this looks way different. It's an American city and... Well, Oops. <laughs> yeah, probably true. Well, it turned out okay, but don't do that at home. <laughs> oh, cool. St. Jude. So this is this church. I've seen this before, actually, when I was here a year ago. Because I remember this thing in front. It really stood out to me. Okay, cool. Can I help with anything? No, it's good. We need help. Go ahead. You guys are doing pretty cool, huh? Yeah. I wasn't expecting to be in church in this trip, but you know, why not? <laughs> YOLO, you know? Well, you never know what's going to happen. So I tried to offer to help with some of the stuff, but um, we ended up like in this crazy place because when I was um, here a little over a year ago, I made a video in Dallas about like the seven things I like or don't like about being in the U.S. after being gone for so long. And I saw this totally crazy thing here. I was starting right in front of that. So I actually totally really recognize this area. And I don't know what we're going to do for a while. We've got to go wander around Dallas and find some stuff and then take the train back. So I guess I can just kind of give it some thoughts now. I mean, obviously taking like roughly two hours to get down here. Then plus, if there's a specific location you need to get to, it's going to take even longer. Um, that's really not practical. And also, you know, these trains aren't running at night, say, when the crowd that, you know, would need to get back because they're drinking would be there. made a decision. The grassy knoll where President John F. Kennedy was shot is very close, uh, but there's a little difficulty for me being pale and blonde. There is no shade here, and maybe it doesn't look that bad, but like right in the city, it just, oh man, it hits really, really hard. So I'm trying to find some way around to get there. I'm at the historical Dealey Plaza, also known as the grassy knoll. This is where the former president, John F. Kennedy, was shot. And there aren't too many people here now. I've seen this actually pretty crowded. And in the street over there, you can see some X's. And over there a little bit in the distance as well. And I see people sometimes actually just laying there, taking photos when there's not all this traffic coming by. So obviously it's a little distasteful because that's where, you know, someone lost their life, but. This looks like a live wire just swaying in the wind, so we're not going to get too close to that. <laughs> Here's the blue line of the dart. This should get us to uptown. Oops. So I need to go four stops on this. So it's kind of working like a tram in Dallas. Um, still not sure how to buy the ticket. We'll see maybe at the other stop we can find a way to buy it. I have no idea how this happened. I guess I just ended up in Deep Ellum instead. I don't know Dallas well enough, but this is the Deep Ellum station. And there's this uh, cool sculpture over there. Uh, 
we can check this out instead. It's actually kind of perfect because this green line goes right back to Trinity Mills. So it'll be easier to get back to Denton when I need to go back. And as I understand it, this is supposed to be some artistic district, but everyone tells me it's gotten like really shady. So we can look around and see and just kind of pay attention to the surroundings. There are no bathrooms on the way here. Um, you know, the guy I met, he was saying about just peeing in the bushes. And I think he was right because even getting to downtown Dallas, everything's saying no public bathrooms. And I think it's possibly just because of the very big homeless population that they're not allowing it. So I kind of really need to go. So that's actually going to be one of the missions is to find somewhere to pee in Deep Ellum. It got me on the channel. Shout out to all the fans. You hear me? Uh, Y'all have a good day. Uh, my name is Eno. Eno, you're Eno. Yeah. It's good meeting you, Eno. Yeah, like, I was just speaking to y'all, <laughs> to all the viewers and stuff. You know what I'm saying? I know I'm out here my shirt off. It's for a reason. What's the reason? Uh, so I can get some money. <laughs> oh, okay. gotcha. It makes sense, yeah. Yeah. I'm right. homeless. You're what? I'm homeless. Oh, yeah, I figured as much, yeah. So. Yeah. But yeah, though. It's good meeting you, man. <laughs> I mean, yeah. <laughs> Uh, hey, uh, See, no shaky video because uh, it's doing all hey, that. Yo, what's up? See, it's recording. Yeah, what's up, y'all? Oh, they can see me. Uh, okay. Yeah, I can see you. Yeah, right there, tiny <laughs> yeah, little screen. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah, uh, we out here. You know what I'm saying? Deep Ellum, Texas. Yeah. yeah, clubs, all that. Ladies, women. Yeah, the whole nine yards. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? This is his YouTube channel. Y'all should come check it out, though. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? You're going to have nice, bring your, bring your kids, your family out here. You hear me? Yeah, hey. Hey, but hey, say, don't come after a certain time, though. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> When's it dangerous? Hey, uh, see, after 12. <laughs> after 12, hey. all right. <laughs> hey. I'm gonna be riding the dart back to Denton in a little bit, so. Yeah, hey. hey, what's up? Yeah. 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 What's up, though? Well, it's, good, it's good meeting you. I'm gonna go wander off a little bit, so right, see you later. That's a camera? Yeah, that's a camera. Check it out. Stabilizing a YouTube channel. Yeah. I decided to take the dart from uh, Denton to Dallas and just the see D what happens. What's that called? DTCAU or something? D something like that. We got like the A train from uh, Denton and then we got a switch. So. Yeah, a switch. Yeah, I know exactly what you're talking about. Yeah, I've never how, been on that. So. How you like it out here? Right. Oh, it's good. I, I used to live in Denton a few years ago, but yeah. now I'm living in Poland of all places. Poland? Yeah, yeah. Oh my God. So, we, you know, we ride trains and stuff all the time, so I wanted to see like what's it like in Denton. Yeah, right next to Ukraine, you know, it's a... Uh, <laughs> Gotta watch out for Putin, you know. Damn. Yeah. That's crazy. That's yeah. So it's good meeting you guys. I'm gonna go wander off. Okay, okay, likewise. All right. See ya. What's your name? See ya. I'm Bill. What's your name? Bill Prince. La Prince. What's your name? Jay. Jay. It's good to meet you. Jay Master. Jay Master. All right. Good to meet you. Yeah, Chucky. <laughs> All right. Have a good day. Well, people here are definitely friendly, that's for sure. So I still need to find the bathroom. I think I found a way to kill two birds with one stone. So I heard about this. This is some like marijuana themed sandwich place or something like that. So I'm actually kind of hungry. So I think I'll go in, get something to eat and use the bathroom, but something's going on. Is that a fire truck? plan in advance. Uh, it took a, quite a while to get my order, maybe 10 or 15 minutes. So I actually really got a rush to make it to the train because this is the last one. It's very inconvenient getting back to Denton. This is the last one and if I don't catch it, I can't make it back today. Now the question is, will Dart take my money and give me a ticket or not? Let's see if it works at the station. So, adult, local PM, 
and so I want to put it in here. I think it's very picky how you do it. Oh my god, it actually took it. And it'll give me the change due. And pass. Awesome. Some police stuff going on. I was about to just uh, eat my sandwich. Let's see what's going on here. And uh, coming through. Right. Yeah, what's happening? What do you think's happening? Oh shit! Really? Oh wow! Oh wow. I was wondering like what they're going after. It's like this real urgent. Uh -huh. So they got the flashlight like, let go they they you know, let the cars pass let know they coming. But yeah, yeah. They don't want to let him know he they come. Yeah, yeah, I gotta be stealthy, yeah. They come to get him. He don't know it. Oh. Oh, that makes a lot of sense, yeah. If you get a siren's automatic, you're going to panic and start shooting people and everything. You know oh, yeah, we don't want that. So they don't yeah, want yeah. Them know they come, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So apparently somebody pushed a button and let them know that it's. Uh, Are there a lot of robberies around here? Not, not in this vicinity. Yeah, but somewhere else Pretty there. Much, uh, further down, like south. You go down further south. South end's more dangerous then, right? Uh, south end, they call it the South Dallas. They call it south the Dallas, South South. Yeah. And uh, you don't want to fuck around over there in. Uh, over there for the north, like Park Lane, Forest Lane. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, they didn't know that now. Yeah, I'm just visiting from out of town, so I don't even know what's okay bad. Right this is okay, yeah. It's okay, yeah. It's right here. You, 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 they got eyes and ears, and yeah. they got plenty of goddamn laws down in this area right here, so you you, you good right here. Yeah, I'll have to try this when I get in. My last chance back to Denton for tonight is arriving. So we're going to get in here. Try this one. Do we think this one's going to be lucky? Debellum Station. This is the Green Line. Final destination, North Carrollton Franksburg Station. Down there. Excuse Next me. Thank you. Carroll Arts District Station. So oh, sorry. Let's sit down here and try. It looks like someone left me a cup of ice. Not gonna touch it. This is super plain, but we'll see how good it tastes. I'm sure they could make a better sandwich for someone with a better taste than me. Pretty good, actually. So, I recommend it. I'm a little tired after walking around all day, so being less talkative and just kind of relaxing in this now so i think i smelt a couple minutes ago like a little bit of weed in the air but now you know, arriving it's, uh, in wood love field station i don't know it's kind of going to be a long Northfield ride back to denton hey, driver, okay oh okay gotcha yeah we did that for years and years and years they worked at a couple of different places like that painted bleachers and did different stuff like that I yeah. mean, we've always had good jobs. Well, now yeah. that I'm in, I do gay porn, so... <laughs> <laughs> well, I heard that pays really well. <laughs> Back at Trinity Mills. And I have maybe like 15 minutes to transfer to Denton, so... You guys are heading another direction then? Oh, where are you going? Denton. Denton? Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so... North it was nice to meet you. Well, it was good to meet you too. So, how long are you gonna be around? Um, I'm going to Detroit on Saturday, okay. and, and then well, back to Poland. Yeah. Around here tomorrow. <laughs> All right. I'll see you. Good talking to you guys. Here is the glory of the Trinity Mills Station at 8:45 p.m. Not too much exciting going on, and that's actually my train. So I think that this is the terminal stop. So they're just probably waiting for us to get back on or something like that i'm not really sure but i don't really want to risk it because uh, nine o'clock is the last one so i think i'm just going to get on so we'll go in the 
I don't know if this is the front or the back. Like, which way is Denton? Is it is it is it back that way or is it forward? So let's go. Okay. Well, not too many people here yet, so we'll just sit down and relax because I have a big day of math tomorrow. The A train has been moving back to Denton. Um, this is pretty much a lot more boring than the the dart. Thank you. Uh, yeah, that was interesting. So I've never done anything like this in the U.S. before. And I mean, obviously, it really was a little ratchet, but I don't know. I think doing it once is fine. I mean, I'm here. I'm reading news articles saying it's more, you know, getting more dangerous. Um, some people say there were some problems sometimes, but, you know, hard to say. I'll say for sure the length of the trip is completely impractical because, you know, for sure you do need a car. You got to drive to the station, at least if you're living in the suburbs, and then it goes somewhere. It takes two hours at least. And I think there needs to be much more of a public uh, transportation infrastructure for this to really work. But anyways, that's it for now. That was the last train back to Denton. Yeah, it's, you, you absolutely cannot party and drink in Dallas and come back because this last train is so early that there's no way that would ever work. So I think, I don't know, I don't have any research to support this, but I very strongly suspect that drunk driving deaths will go down in the United States if there's any actual reasonable public, in, uh, public transp transportation infrastructure, although I think there is very little incentive for that right now, unfortunately, because it's so car-based, so... I'm going to go out. It's uh, almost 10, which is still early for me, but I'm going to just rest. So usual, you know, if you like, comment, subscribe, all this sort of stuff, it really helps the channel. And I'll be out until the next video.